Hello everybody, Elsa Farmer here and welcome back to my channel. So we got another new map today. This is called Jack Pine. This is by Shanty Boys Map Creations. These guys have also made some other forestry maps. Uh, yes, this is a logging map. There are thousands of trees. Field prices are ridiculous low. <laughs> so, <laughs> well, there are actually only six fields. It is a full 2x map. The size on this map is, you know, megabyte size, it's only 24.63 megabyte to download. So, you know, <laughs> where do we start? Well, this is the map. What do we start with? This whole area over here. Field prices, as I said, it's divided into six. So if we go to this one, which is, this is a full 2x map, by the way. So it's big. 31,000. <laughs> this one is 41,000. 37, 23, and 36. So really cheap field prices. But as I said, it's only forestry, but there are many flat areas where you can, you know, take out the, the forestry and make your own fields. I'm going to show you that, an example. Uh, cell points, there are four cell points. The ranch, which is your main cell point for your crops. And you got your spinnery for your wool and cotton. And then you have the sawmill, which will buy your wood chips or logs. And then you also have a barn for your silage and your grass products. Even though it says uh, manure and slurry, there are no BGA on this map. And as you can see, the road system is pretty easy. You can also take shortcuts uh, to the woods there, of course. There is a small lake down here. Now, contracts are not available <laughs> currently. It doesn't say if this is seasons ready or not, or position farming ready or not. There are no animal pens on this map, but you can place one. I'm also going to show you that. I know this is not everybody's cup of tea, so to speak, but I know there are a lot of people out there doing only logging. Uh, I haven't done it, but maybe we can jump into it sometimes. Uh, it seems very frightening when you start in a place like this and you only see a whole lot of forestry ahead of you. I'm going to show you how it could, could look like if you just do a little bit work on it. Uh, what do we start with equipment? Well, we have a style with a 175 horsepower. You got a Deutsch Fahr with 336. You got a Sampo Rosenlev, a forestry or logging machine, so to speak. You got a trailer. You got a log trailer with a crane. You got a front lifter, front loader. You got a, a grabber, a log grabber for your front loader. You got a weight, and that's about it. There was no sleep trigger on this map. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you start there, and in this area, if we go into the map, you own the area where the shop is, which is pretty handy on a map like this. So if you buy something, it will spawn over here. Your equipment and vehicles are just around the corner here. Did I mention the slot count? No, the slot count is really low. Maybe you saw it. Slot count is 253. Now I'm gonna jump in now and I'm gonna show you how it will look when you start it on uh, Farm Manager. 
farm manager, you start at the same place. What do you have of equipment? Well, you have everything that you have on the new farmer. Slot count is 253. Looking at the map, you don't own anything. But now, you have all equipment and you have a little bit more money. And the, the field prices there are humongous and cheap as chips. So you can buy this one and you can start just the same as New Farmer but with 1.2 million in your bank account. So there we go, that's Farm Manager. Are there any other farms on the map? Well, there is one area over here. You don't own this area. Oop. It's more or less in the middle of the map. Uh, so, you know, if you want to sell that and buy this one, you can always do that. It is a pretty, pretty decent flat area. So, I'm just gonna, first of all, before we drive around to the cell points, I'm just gonna show you how you could do this. Uh, there are some mods that you can use for clearing out the trees without, you know, having a lot of logs in your way. So, yeah, I'm just gonna jump in and show you. I played around for half an hour. Uh, the, the clip isn't a half an hour. <laughs> Relax. So, there we go. That's how you could do it. As I said, I had never done a forestry map before, so... Uh, so, we... I'm not gonna... This is gonna be a pretty quick map tour. Uh, most of the area here are only trees. Pine trees. Uh, first up, the first set point is pretty close around the corner here. That's the spinnery. And then uh, we head out south to the ranch and the animal dealer. So here we are looking at the minimap. We are down at the spinnery which will buy a wool and cotton. And then I will drive down here and I'll see you at the animal dealer and the ranch. And as you can see, it's not completely flat. There are some uh, hills and small mountains knocking around. But yeah, mainly forest. So 
So now we are all the way on the southeast of the map. So this is the main cell point, the ranch. It will not only take your normal crops, it will also take your root crops like potatoes, sugar beets and sugar cane and milk and eggs, I believe. Let's check uh, ranch, bum, bum, bum. yeah, potatoes, egg, milk, there we go. And you got a gas station over here. Animal dealer is just over here. There we go. You know, I have, uh, you know, taken a flyby through the forestry and you know, had a look for <laughs> hidden uh, gems or uh, any people having a party in the middle of the forest. I haven't found anything. There might be some hidden things. You never know. So, uh, now I'm going up here. This is just a placeable area. And we are going up to the sawmill. So here we are coming up to the sawmill, wood chip cell point is just in there, I believe. If we go here and we go to sawmill and tag it, you will see there is some markings on the floor there. Cell point is probably here, the tag is probably a little bit off as usual. Selling your logs is just inside these box or these hazard marks here and you just go on this point to sell your wood. Nice and easy. <laughs> Nothing uh, spectacular and complicated about this map. It is, it's not completely like no man's land, uh, you know, you cannot remove all the trees here like you can on no man's land, but you know, for roleplay, starting here with a chainsaw and starting from scratch. So, and uh, now we need to go up to the left here. So, also here, nice and easy, tidy and clean. <laughs> this is the barn cell point. We are now all the way up here. So the barn will buy your silage, your all your grass products. And I think that was all the cell points. Uh, let me see. Yeah, and you don't have a silo. So, but you can always have, there's a whole lot of uh, mods that you can place down. Uh, you can also, if we look at the map now, we can drive straight over here and, whoa. Now you need to use the map. There is a big hill up here where we can get a more overview of the map.
Oh, you know what? I'm just gonna go up here. Uh, let me see. I think it was over here where we can get a more glance of the <laughs> the map. And there is a hill over here. And as you can see, mainly forestry. Oh. There we go, this is spot. You can see the cell points all the way down there. So there we go. That's Jack Pine by Shanty Boys Map Creations. I'm probably stuck here now. <laughs> Let's say a perfect uh, map if you want to start with nothing, just a chainsaw, or you really love doing forestry, then this is the map for you. Oh, some nice open areas here. So, anyway, that was it for this quick map tour on Jack Pine. Thank you for watching, hit that like button and all those bells and whistles and hopefully I will see you the next time. <laughs> oh, I'm never gonna find my home now. I need to go south. <laughs>